Well, lately on this show, it seems like we've been spending a lot of time fighting misinformation, but it just keeps coming up. We keep getting your text. We keep fact checking. Today, it's with Idaho's Lieutenant Governor, who is actively campaigning to become Idaho's next governor. Yesterday, Lieutenant Governor Janice McGeehan sent a campaign email claiming that Boise State is imposing vaccine passports on their fans. She says, quote, in an email, this last weekend, Boise State University opted to impose a vaccine passport mandate on students attending the home football game. They further announced that this mandate would be imposed on all attendees for future games, end quote. Now, the lieutenant governor included a copy of Governor Little's executive order from earlier this year, which says no state entity can require vaccine passports to access state services or facilities. And technically, Boise State is a state entity because it's a public university. McGeehan then linked to a KTVB article about Boise State's new policy, highlighting only a portion of the headline. First, vaccine passports are banned in the state of Idaho, per an executive order issued by Governor Little back in April. It says that, quote, no department, agency, board, commission, or other executive branch entity or official of the state of Idaho shall require as a condition of accessing state services or facilities that an individual produce proof that he or she has received a COVID-19 vaccine. So technically, yes, Boise State is requiring students and possibly all fans for the Boise State Broncos next home game to provide proof of, proof of vaccination to get in. However, that's not the only way to get in. Boise State's also giving fans the option to instead provide proof of a negative COVID test in a place of showing a vaccine card. So whether you're vaccinated or not, you can take the second option and show a COVID test. So there's a choice. It's not one or done, meaning the policy does not violate Governor, Lato, Governor Little's executive order. Words matter. And when you send out words in a campaign email, those words matter as well. And you may disagree with what Boise State is doing to protect our community from COVID, but when you say that Boise State University opted to impose a vaccine passport mandate, it's simply not true. By the way, still no update on if that Boise State policy will expand to all fans when Nevada comes to town on October 2nd on the blue.